so I have a tip. Don't use waterproof um, pencils because... <laughs> Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Kelly, a very happy Friday out there to everybody watching. Today I want to try something new. I'm somewhat nervous but I I don't know what this is. It's an eyebrow stencil and that's about as all as far as I know. Um, I saw this is on an ad. I was I don't know who I was watching but they had ad sense on and um, a video of this thing. I don't know if it was this exact thing that popped up, but and then I went to Amazon. I found this. Uh, we're going to try it out. Anyway, so if you're excited, stay tuned because there's a lot of silliness coming in. Hey, beautiful Friday. If you wouldn't mind smashing the like button, make sure that you are subscribed so you don't miss out on um, any future fun <laughs> that we have here. Um, I'm slightly nervous. This is either going to go really, really amazing and this is like the best thing ever or it's going to go <laughs> terribly wrong, but I'm... <laughs> oh, lots of coffee. Um, anyways, this is the box I do want to show you here. I, I'm not even going to try to pronounce it here. Um, these are the different shapes. Basically, it's this machine kind of thing where you can twist and turn it and you can create your eyebrow shape. I have... I do struggle with my eyebrows once in a while, um, and then there's more oh, information there. But anyways, I do struggle with my eyebrows. This eyebrow sits lower on my face um, than my left side here, so I, this might be a really cool thing. I'm going to do my eyebrows really, really quick. I'm going to look extremely silly. I have full face on. Anything I have on my face will be down in the description box. I'm going to sit here and ramble for a little bit more because I'm slightly nervous, a little bit anxious. <laughs> <laughs> this <is> insane. <laughs> oh, has anybody else seen the ad of like she's just like puts it on her face, she's like dee -dee -dee, and she's done. How oh, just do it, right? Rip off the band-aid and get in here. Okay, so I haven't even opened the box. Um I ordered this back in December, but <laughs> I don't know. I'll put it on this month. Um I did get this on Amazon. Did I say that? If, if not, I bought this on Amazon. I'll have I'll have a link down to what this. There was three colors. I don't even remember. I'm really nervous. Highly caffeinated. Very nervous. Um, anyways, um, this is... <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do with this. <laughs> what are we doing with this? Um, it's plastic. Oh, that's cool. For storage. So it, it folds down pretty nice. Or you could hook it on like to the, the side of a basket or something. That's kind of cool. Okay. You move these things, the buckle. These are called a buckle, these dark pink things. So, I don't want to break it. It's plastic. I mean, I thought I was expecting anything. I mean, it's, it was $11. Oh, and I have very weak fingers. Ooh, okay. So, all right. And you can figure your shape this way. That's cool. So if you like your eyebrows shaped like this. It seems like a really big eyebrow. Is my eyebrow really that big? Yeah, that seems pretty close. This <laughs> is gonna be fun. <laughs> I don't even... Oh, I'm either gonna... My eyebrows are gonna be like this on my face. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be fun. Okay, so you can move them like this, which is cool. And then you can move this thing. Okay, let's get them all right the same shape. So we're going to bend it. The buckle here has like a little knob. So you can, and then there's, there's holes in the, the gold part here. So you have three options. Um, okay. So this is the shape I would like. I'm going to zoom you in. <laughs> we're just going to go with it, right? Oh, Oh my gosh, I'm <laughs> so nervous to do this. All right, all right. Okay, it snapped back. Oh, that's right. I can move it that way. Okay, that'll work, right? Yeah. But then I would want it like the same, right? Oh my goodness. 
this is a little bit, this, I'm frustrated. Um, not frustrated. I'm, I'm very nervous. I need it to bend in. All right. Are we even? <laughs> we can do this. Okay. I'm just going to use a Topi pencil. This is going to be either rock star or crazy. I'm also not coordinated like whatsoever. So this might be a little bit of a learning curve. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> okay. That looks like a really big brow for me. Because usually I like. I think it would come down my left. Oh, I really want to film after this. Um. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is just, because it doesn't tell me how to do this, I'm going to follow the bottom line. Right there. And then I'm just going to, because I like the brush strokes. Brush strokes. Um, hair-like strokes that way. This makes me really nervous to color this in, but let's, let's, let's do it anyway. For the sake of the video, let's hair like stroke, then fill that side in. I'm sorry, I should have turned. Oh, crazy nervous to do this. Okay, that's seems, I mean, as far as what I can tell. So, oops. Oh, this is awkward. Same thing. I'm going to follow, um, with a straight line on the bottom and then hair like strokes here to help fill in as I usually would. Um, and then color this in because we did on the other side. Oh my goodness. I mean, it is actually really quick. Are we ready to take this off? I mean, oh, this would have been really fun doing this live. Okay, so filled in as far as like my stencil. Oh, that's not bad. I actually... I mean, oh, I don't, <laughs> I did, I did struggle with this side. Let's, actually, I really, really like this side. How can we fix this? Let's, let's put this back and see if we can fix this. Okay. Get it back to where we were. Okay. Maybe, cause this side doesn't really like touch my face well. And I'm also trying to do, like, over my hand here. No, like, it's not. I'm holding that side of the stencil down. Okay, let's freehand it from here. Um. Can I fix this? Maybe, I mean, like I said, maybe I am, um, I should be, like, pulling this off. Like my eyebrows here. Maybe I am misshaping my eyebrows. I don't think this is perfect right now because like I said, maybe I've been doing my eyebrows wrong. This eyebrow is fantabulous. It's beautiful. So I almost wonder if I've been mistweezing this side of my eye because I mean, looking at it, I could absolutely see this like there's more space here than there is here. So maybe I've been tweezing my eyebrows wrong. I'm miss maintaining my eyebrows because when I turn my head, it's, it's kind of thick. Whereas this one is very nice and tapered. And I was really hesitant to go that far up, but I actually really like it. So one good, one bad. Okay, so I think what I'm going to say is, I'm gonna say this first round is first impressions with this little guy here. I want to say I actually kind of like it. Um, this eyebrow looks really, really nice. Um, but this eyebrow is a little bit kind of 
off, but I think it's my own fault. Like I think it's my own maintenance fault because looking in the mirror, like dead on, this is very much so shaped, I think the way I've always wanted my eyebrows shaped. And this one, because it comes down, my actual hairs are coming down. So I think it's just mine. So I'm going to call this a first impressions round one. Uh, first in my first impression is I'm kind of digging it. It's goofy. It's really goofy, but I'm going to reshape my eyebrows tonight. I might film it. Maybe I will film it. Um, we'll see. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and shape my eyebrows and we're going to see if this will work tomorrow. So I'm going to do like a, a second impression and see if that helps. Okay. It is the end of the night. I have all of my makeup off. I'm going to zoom you in. We are going to try to see if this works as a uh, stencil for maintaining um, and tweezing. I have a black eyeliner. I have some tweezers and of course I have this tool sitting here. So let's zoom you in. Okay. I really hope this works because this would be really cool. I really did realize that I have been not maintaining my eyebrows correctly because this eyebrow hair, like, and now that it's been pointed out, I can actually see these eyebrow hairs definitely are arched differently. And I loved this side. So we're going to make this one work. Uh, for a while, I may be missing a good chunk of my eyebrow on the outside, but I mean, such is life, but I would rather them look nice than uneven, I guess. So here we go. Um, I'm really nervous again. <laughs> oh, what a silly, silly day we are having today. Okay. The, I'm looking at the space between the outside of the corner of my eye and like this little um, dot here to make sure that they are sitting even on my face. Um, looking forward. But I mean, if you see it, like it is crooked, but my eyebrows aren't set like the same on my eyes. Okay. I think we're even. I have a freshly sharpened pencil here. Oh, I am nervous. <sighs> okay. Yeah. This pencil glides really, really nice. All right. So there's that. See how much further I should be taking this off right here? Make sure that looks even. Yeah? It's kind of hard to see. Um. <laughs> oh, do I look ridiculous. <laughs> if this helps, I mean, I'm all for it. Okay. Um. Tweezers. Oh, another thing that is really helpful when doing your eyebrows is a spoolie right here. So I have a spoolie so we can brush all the hairs up and out of the way and then down and out of the way. So we get a very good shaped <laughs> I really appreciate everybody being here. Uh, this is some silliness. I'm really nervous to do this. They look even, right? I wish, um, I wish I could phone a friend. Right? That's a lot of eyebrow to come off. It's just eyebrows. Okay. So I'm going to go and just get all of the hairs that are below this line. Um, and I'm going to take the spoolie and just brush them down so I can see what's on the top that needs to come off. All right. Brush it all out. Not on the way. <sighs> This might be the, this is, this is seriously going to be the best thing or the worst thing ever. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. This is the part that's going to make me nervous because there's a lot here, but it matches this side. So I'm okay. Right. Tell me I'm okay. I mean, if, tell me I'm all right right now. It's just eyebrows. It's just eyebrows. I guess if it's bad. I can update everybody at the end of the month, which I will do anyways, but here we go. We're going to take all this eyebrow off. Anybody else really nervous? You nervous for me? I'm nervous for me. So there's that. Um, I don't know. What do you think? Let's wipe this off and let's 
reapply the eyebrow pencil and see if it actually works. So I have a tip, don't use waterproof um, pencils because... <laughs> I don't know what's worse right now. <laughs> I do recommend cleaning all of the liner off of this. I'm actually going to try this again tomorrow. My eyebrows are very, very irritated. So I'm just going to go throw some aloe on, put the rest of my skincare on, call it a night, um, and not put more eyebrow um, stuff on. So we will be back in just a couple minutes with a fresh face and a new day. Welcome to day two of this kind of trial with this guy. Um... Yesterday I did try this for the first time and then realized that my eyebrows were uneven on my face so I did a maintenance to try to see if this works. So today I want to put it back on my face to see now that I have better maintained and even eyebrows if this will work. So I'm going to zoom you in and we're going to do this. Okay I'm going to go in with my Wonder Beauty pencil. And I have, I will say this, I have different makeup, makeup on than yesterday. I'll have both sets of makeup on my face fully listed down in the comments or description box. <sighs> Lots of coffee, um, very rambly, but I'm also starting to get hungry. So there's that. But anyways, um, I didn't move this at all. I did just lay this on my desk over here. Um, so it should be positioned correctly. It's just Hopefully I can get this back on my face correctly. That's one thing that I was really worried about, whether or not I could get it back in the right place. <sighs> New day. We will try this. I will keep trying this all through the month too, so. Okay, so I have it positioned, I think, where it was. And I'm just going to start going in here. And I like fresh brush strokes up front here. I do those really quick. And then, just like yesterday... I'm going to line my eyebrow here. This isn't uncomfortable, I will say, either. I just, it's, it's odd, obviously, because I am not used to using a stencil for my eyebrows, but it's, I look absolutely silly, but this isn't that bad. Same thing, I'm just going to do light brush strokes over here in the front and then trace along the bottom line here. And then we have to fill in because I had misshapen eyebrows yesterday. And hopefully this looks a lot better. And off. Brush them just a little bit. In the front right here, I feel like just a little bit. I I have very thin eyebrows in the center here, so that's the only thing I'm seeing that I don't like. They definitely do look even as far as like right here, which I like. Um not sure why this one looks maybe I didn't have it on the same spot I don't know looking at a straight on it though I think these eyebrows oops where do I I think looking at a straight on I think my eyebrows look really really great I although this side is a little bit thicker than it was yesterday it doesn't come to a point like this one this one beautiful so this one was beautiful yesterday this one is, is beautiful today I don't think looking straight on, though, they look bad. So looking straight on, they look really, really nice. I'm I'm pleasantly surprised. So I'm going to zoom you out for some final thoughts. I did take a little bit of concealer and I clean up the thickness there just for today. I might have to readjust this side. I'm not sure. I will keep playing with it. I will absolutely put it on my list to review for the month of January. I will... I do my reviews... Um, like that typically the second week or at least halfway through the next month so that I do have a full month with each product because I don't know but first impressions even though this is second day this is first impressions with well-maintained eyebrows so we're still gonna call this, call this first impressions first impressions with this guy I thought this was gonna be super gimmicky I thought I don't know what in the world I got myself into but 
but I really like this. I think this is fantastic. I struggle with my eyebrows a lot of times because I do. This eyebrow is set lower than this eyebrow. So even when I have been maintaining my eyebrows myself, I have to over tweeze this eyebrow to come up and I have to pull this one down. And I thought they were even on my face. And after I used this yesterday, it was not because this one did place in like the distance between my eye, like the outer corner of my eye and right here, this lid space right here was different yesterday. So I did have to take off quite a bit of like ba basically the end of my eyebrow. I did have to take that off and now they're even. And when I look at myself, I feel like they are symmetric, more symmetrically placed, I guess, on my face. And I think my face looks better. <laughs> I guess your face is not symmetrical um, by any means, but I mean, fake it till you make it kind of thing. And with makeup, that's, that's what I did. I I love this. And then, so we maintained yesterday. I will say, I don't know if I said it yesterday, but I will say, um, don't use a waterproof eyeliner. <laughs> mistake number one. I made the mistake. Don't, don't make, don't make the Kelly mistake. Use an eyeliner that is not waterproof. Um, <laughs> oh, that was, I was trying to scrub it off. But anyways, um, <laughs> it was so horrible. But anyways, you can use this to help maintain your eyebrows. So like I just placed it there and then I did, I mean, you guys seen it. I used the eyeliner and then I tweezed outside of that eye eyeliner. That is fantastic. I think this is fantastic. It, it helps me draw on proper eyebrows, but it also helps me with proper maintenance. I I'm slightly embarrassed to say that I have not been properly maintaining my eyebrows and they were wonky on my eyes. And that makes a lot of sense because sometimes I'm like, I don't know why this eye looks better than that eye or vice versa. My eyebrows were placed differently on my face and I maintained them that way. I put my eyebrows in that position. Anyways, this is $11. Oh, it was $11 when I bought it. I will leave a link down in the comment section, down in the description box. One of these days. Anyways, I did get this off Amazon when I purchased it. It was $11, like $11.06 or something crazy, but I think like full price it was $15. It is plastic. There were other color options. I can only think of like a white other option. I I picked, I picked pink. I like pink. <laughs> um, I think this is a really handy dandy tool. I really, really do. I don't, I was kind of hesitant. It's going to be awkward to hold. It's not actually, you know, you just, you place it here and da 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 da. And I will say yesterday, I kind of, I thought it was really awkward to do this side because I am right handed. So I was like crossing my body and it was a little awkward. Today when I was doing it, I didn't feel as awkward. I didn't feel that awkwardness. So muscle memory and I, I am enjoying this $11 Amazon find and is with as goofy as I look using it as goofy as it I felt using it I think this is really cool <laughs> final thoughts this was worth my $11 I would have paid full price I like this I the plastic is a little cheap um so I do say caution in that but I like that it does move this way. You can reshape this as to how you like it. It does bend this way too. So it also fits your face that way. Oh, this was a very silly video, but I think I found something pretty awesome. If you wouldn't mind, smash the like button. If, if you loved this video, go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss out on any of more fun. If you ever find something silly, whether, cause I seen this in a, a YouTube ad, like the AdSense YouTube ad died laughing, like what in the world is she doing to her face? But then I was like, well, well now I want to try it. To try to, I had to find it on Amazon. So do you ever find something silly like that and you want me to try it out? Let me know. I'm. I would love to do that for you. But anyways, I hope everybody has an amazing weekend. I hope today was a lot of fun and I will see you in the next video. Bye.